try. No. <laughs> no. Hey, everybody, and welcome to the new episode of Real Talk Central Podcast, the podcast where I sit in my college dorm room and talk. And today I'm joined by two very special guests. Who am, who am I with? Emma. Emma. <laughs> yeah, so I have my two friends, Emma's, Emma's, Emma Squared, I'm here, scared, yeah. and um, we we haven't picked out a topic, so we're just gonna go along with whatever. So, what should we talk about today? Uh, they they were just in um, the town where I am, and they're like, "What are you doing now?" And I was like, "I'm on my shift," and they visit me, and I give them free cupcakes. Uh, I hope no one at my work actually watches this show. So. <laughs> Oh, okay. Talk close to the mic. Okay. So, yeah, yeah, like um, weed or something. Yeah. So, I guess, um, lately, I've looked up a lot of stuff about Ouija boards, and I guess I was kind of okay. interested in talking about it, because um, the reason why people uh, make Ouija boards work when they put their hands on them is because of... Um, this thing where when you believe oh i saw yeah, I saw yeah. That. yeah. and then like your body will your actually body will actually do it so if you say like i'm gonna start moving my hand up like you start slow like do you see that shit like i'm moving it up but like i'm not actually moving do it. you guys see it guys do you see you it can, yeah, no, you, you can't see it. see it but like <laughs> but yeah um it's just kind of crazy to me because like the fact that um certain like people like are put like so much faith in like Ouija boards like I have this one friend and like she will like ask it like so many questions and stuff like that and it like it knows things but it's really just like her knowing it and like doing it am I virgin yes oh my gosh. <laughs> that's creepy and it could be like the spirits like controlling over your body and yeah. having you move that's that's creepy yeah, that's and scary weird. but it's also spirit? very cool that's like a that's a conversation so like with the talk of like spirits and ghosts are ghosts real uh do, honestly, do you believe in ghosts does everyone hear like um, um i don't know i don't know stop copying me okay <laughs> um so for me like i have always kind of had like a weird thing about ghosts like i believed in them for like such a long time and like i thought I, i've seen ghosts but now i'm like not even sure because of just like so much like things i've looked into like a lot of it is like you know, completely explainable by science. So I just am like, are there ghosts? And like, if they're ghosts, like, how does that like pertain to like the afterlife? Like, is there an afterlife? You know, if there are ghosts, That's right? Me. Like, what happens after death? So if if angels like are real, they say like, oh, like your your loved ones are like looking over you. So if angels are real, like, are ghosts not, or are they? You know, because they're they, I guess basically they're the same thing. You know, because an angel is also, like, technically, like, a holy ghost, I, I would mean, someone say. I guess, like, what I think about ghosts is that, like, there are people who have unfinished business, like, on Earth. So, like, right. if somebody uh, hasn't, co like, uh, done everything they want to in their life, I feel like their spirit is uh, not able to rest yet, I guess. And that's why they're a ghost. I feel like that's why there's a lot of, like, evil ghosts is that, like, the people that end up being ghosts or people who have like malintentions with like the world and like I feel like you can't really be at rest until you've come to uh accept your own death I don't know that's that's what I think ghosts are if there are ghosts I don't know I just think it's kind of like oh spooky like those top 10 like like scary videos on the internet Miss Mojo or no something watch like that. Mojo <laughs> number 10 spooky ghost video which by the way that channel is totally running out of ideas top 10 reasons why homer simpson is a bad husband like what come on what, what did top he 10 reasons do? Emma's a lesbian which one okay anyways <laughs> um, so uh yeah but ghosts are i don't know ghosts are interesting i feel like a lot of ghosts have um co i've come into contact with ghosts no, if ghosts special. exist but like I've never actually used a Ouija board or anything like that because I guess my parents have always like ingrained into my head that that's like evil. I guess I don't know. I've never used a Ouija board, but I have like used other like methods of talking to like spirits and ghosts. Like uh, what? Um, do, do you know what a pendulum is? You know the thing where you're, like it, it's <gasps> you like dangle on a something. Yes. Yeah. So it was it was what the, towards the beginning of senior year. And that was when all the the shit was happening. And then you remember remember that that thing that I that I used to have, and then I would like talk to. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So that basically that's what I that's what I used. And then um, 
I got some interesting facts from there. And but I don't know, it was like super cool. So I know that like whenever you use like a, a Ouija board or a, like a pendulum or anything like that, you need to like prepare for it. You need to like call on the like the different spirits or Holy Spirit, like invite them to be a part of this conversation. Then you also need like a like a gemstone there or something. And then also you need a picture. It's like Skyrim. Of, yeah, or yeah, basically. Or like <laughs> Did the, you get the gemstones? Yeah, you need to like lay a bunch of stuff out. You need um like have a picture of whoever you're trying to come in contact with or whatever it's like associated with and stuff like that. And uh, it, it was it was super cool. Uh, I don't do that anymore. There's no reason for me to, but um, have you, Emma, you you guys don't know which one I'm looking at. Have you used anything? Stiffy on. <laughs> um, um, no, I don't, no, I don't think so. I mean, mm. I just kind of like, I think like sometimes my dreams feel really weird, but then I realize oh, I'm just dreams. like looking at stuff that's like beforehand. Like, t like last night I had a really weird dream about this girl and then she like got really mad at me and she's always kind of angry at me in real life but it's like whatever but i saw a post of her like like the morning of which is this morning and I, was, I saw it last night and i was like oh fuck like that's where that's where like the dream came from oh yeah oh. i don't it's know like demonetized wait it... i don't know <laughs> who who fuck watches this okay <laughs> but <laughs> <laughs> we can say like anything no let's not do yeah. that okay anyways um i don't know ghosts interesting ouija board's interesting but like demons like, are there, Demon, are there demons, the thing, yeah, I guess? Like, do, are, do demons exist? Mm -hmm. Or, like, because, like, voodoo? Like, that freaks me out. Like, voodoo dolls. Ooh. Like... ASMR dolls? <laughs> Ew! <laughs> Surprise, no! Okay, um... I don't know. Yeah. Um, voodoo is scary. Like, I always wanted to go to New Orleans, because that's where, like, a lot of voodoo stuff is there's like like buzzfeed unsolved like they've gone to like a lot oh i love yeah. buzzfeed unsolved they've gone oh, to like yeah. a, they've gone to like a lot of um like uh, islands and a like lot of deserted islands. places yeah, yeah and like i don't know it's just kind of weird that um a lot of the a lot of the things that they use to contact ghosts like i they've never really gotten like definitive answers with any of those things which is another reason why i'm like are ghosts real like if they haven't gotten anything yet like they've been doing it for years now you know <laughs> Wait, or or how about ooh, um, ooh, that like all this talk about like spirits like leads into what conspiracy theories? So like Buzzfeed Unsolved like talks about conspiracy theories, and Shane Dawson is a huge conspiracy theorist. Um, what what are there any conspiracy theories that you know? A, a big conspiracy. Okay, this is kind of an interesting one. Is that um. The natural disasters, like the California wildfires, mm -hmm. were like actually caused by the government. Which lasers, I, yeah. Yeah, which I don't mm. know if I necessarily believe that, but like, it's kind of weird how like certain things come into play at certain times. Like, there's definitely like um, a lot of uh, I don't want to get contra. I don't know. I, I basically just interesting timing of a lot of different things. So without getting into the politics of things, yeah. I was mm -hmm. watching um, The Simpsons like predicts whatever and like like a <laughs> montage of it, and I was like, crap, like that like so. Okay, but like I don't believe that. I think that just The Simpsons You're wrong. has You're so. You're wrong. Listen, listen. Okay, The Simpsons has so many episodes that at some point stuff is going to match up with like future things, and like a lot of the stuff that they predict is like. Oh, there was a there was a magazine with a nine. But I'm talking <laughs> nine, uh, like nine okay. twin towers. Like, no, what? or what about Trump becoming president? And literally, he, like he the will, same like, shot, wah, wah, wah. and then the person drops the sign in the background. Same thing happening. I don't know. Like for any, like they they could have just freaking made that animation after that shot came, and people like just don't remember or whatever. Um, All silent over there, It was like Emma. Squidward dabbing. Like, that didn't <laughs> actually happen, but then people oh, were yeah. like, D he dabbed in the show! And then they made, like, a fake one. Duba, but no, duba. he didn't dab in the show. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Also, it's just, like, The Simpsons, like, in my experience, like, it is a satire, so it is making, like, points about society, so it's not like, it's not like they're just randomly, like, doing stuff and they magically, like, suddenly predict things. It's that, like, I think a lot of the things that they were, like, commentating on every joke is a cry for help Oop. anyways yeah do that who's the girl so, on your home screen oh that that is <laughs> <laughs> that is miranda miller uh she used to be in hey violet oh yeah oh uh, 
I'm, I'm no! gonna cry. No! no. Okay, one time gonna... Jason pranked me and sent me lyrics to Hey Violet, and I was really, really confused. And I actually like at first, like I could, I could tell it was one of those things. But then as the further he got into it, I was like, maybe he's like actually being serious because I've never heard the song before. Right. Yeah. So, and then he said the one thing, and then I was like, oh, okay, never mind. I want to die. If you've been on this channel for a long time, you might remember that video. Yeah, that, that was, was fun. That that was like it. the early days of YouTube. Oh my gosh. Fortnite. Yeah. Fortnite. Yeah. Fortnite. Oh, yeah, but Miranda Miller, so she's no longer in the band, but she's a voice teacher now. She's a private oh. voice lesson teacher. And also, she does a podcast with her friend uh, Matthew, in which was sort of like kind of an inspiration for this podcast. I've been wanting to do a podcast for a long time, but that was like the final push. Me like, I should just do it Wait, already. what episode is this? Um, This is episode f f f six, I think. Oh. I don't know. I, I missed last weekend, so, okay. um, so I'm just going to... Do another one. I was supposed to record a podcast with my mom and sister because we saw Story Story Four. And we were gonna do like a review on it. Oh. Yeah, I guess that'll be sometime in the future. But well, yeah. What about the illegally streamed movies tab? Oh, <laughs> and it has a picture of a. So yeah, I have this um, icon on my desktop called oh, illegally streamed God. movies, and there's a guy in a <laughs> in a ski mask on a laptop. So that that's it's one of those like one two three movies website where you can watch free movies. But, um, ooh, one conspiracy theory that I know. Um, well, y you, you, you both X, follow X, my... X, Yes, that one. Wait, oh. which one? <laughs> no, okay, so, um, you both follow my fans. I think yeah, I, 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 I did a post, uh, recently about a walk-in freezer about, uh, Kanika <gasps> yeah, Jenkins. So, yeah, no, 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 I haven't, I didn't see that. Oh, okay, so, that. so I'll go over the conspiracy theory first. So, um, there is the Crown Plaza in Chicago. So Crown Plaza, you know, it's like the hotel place okay. franchise yeah, yeah the natalie crown plaza okay continue okay so one i think this happened maybe like two years ago or something like that there was a girl i think she i don't know what age she was but she was underage um oh. and she was drinking at the party her name was kanika oh. jenkins and she got you know drunk and she walked down into the hotel's kitchen <laughs> walked into the walk-in freezer locked herself in there and froze to death well, overnight. Okay, I disbelieve that. She definitely got murdered. And that's the conspiracy theory yeah. because there are like so many like um like different things. Like there is there's a theory that um she was like put inside of a garbage bag cuz there was this oh. this video of this surveillance video of this janitor uh rolling a cart and there's like this very suspicious suspicious suspiciously shaped trash bag oh. that was there and it definitely looked like it had a body and then later on when uh videos of like her like lying down the freezer came out there was like a like a shred of garbage bag oh, underneath her nail weird. and so that she could have like tried to claw her way out so there's just many like different things that oh, are like weird gosh. about it and then what's even more like why it's that conspiracy theory is creepy to me is because my dad's a dj and he was djing at the crown plaza that no! weekend oh no! That's why it oh scares God, me so scary. much. Okay, wait, I want to just put something out there, okay? I just want to put something out there. The The fact of the matter is well, no drunk person would be cognitive enough to walk into the freezer and then lock themselves in. I can understand mm -hmm. if she was, like, trying to figure out how to oh get goodness. out. Like, how do how did I, how did I, she closed the door on herself. She would know that she was in the freezer. Like, what was she looking for? Like, why yeah. would she go in there in the first drinks. place? Oh. Well, yeah, but they wouldn't, be, they wouldn't be in the freezer. <laughs> She's looking for extra drinks in the she freezer. Said, well, I we should find something in here. We should have joke about that. Yeah, that's terrible. No. I, I bet I, I'm like 90 million percent sure she was probably murdered. I don't oh know. yeah, and her her mom thinks so. Like she oh, yeah, um definitely. she was on the news being like something inside of that hotel murdered my my child. Who's like a dog? Yeah, but they they closed the case and it's complete bullshit. They closed it. Yeah, and there's like a hashtag justice for Kanika, which. Yeah, that's. Yeah. Like, also, like, on. okay, it does not matter if she was drinking or not. Like, the fact of the matter is, is that like no person would just go into a freezer. For no reason, like th that just that's stupid to me. They, she definitely got murdered, or like some weird foul play was yeah. going on there. Oh. Yeah. And there, there's more to like the the story as well. Um, like uh, I think part of, parts of her clothes were ripped off and everything like that. Oh, like there was a part missing from her know. from her jacket. Stop making jokes. <laughs> But this, this is a terrible podcast. <laughs> <laughs> we're, we're just talking about like supernatural other conspiracy Nintendo Switch, different things. Yes or no? Yeah. Um. Yes. Except I'm I'm soon gonna be getting new Joy Cons because my left Joy Con keeps drifting, which is a. What's your guys' favorite people. game so far? 
on the Switch, yeah. Breath of the Wild and Smash Ultimate. Definitely probably that. But like what like I uh, so if I don't have any friends, right? So like obviously Smash is fun and all. Breath of but the Wild. You don't have any friends. Yeah. Yeah, I, I feel like fighting games like Mortal Kombat or Smash is like only fun when you're with friends that's you know? so true i mean i don't know smash brothers to me it only has appeal to people who have like siblings or friends Oop. and like or are complete nerds <laughs> over ko for me or who are complete nerds over smash <coughs> cody wait so oh. and i oop. and i oop. <laughs> no and i love I, you cody i love whoop. smash and I hoop. can i hit the whoa <laughs> so cool. like we're in a car now jason yeah. okay so like any other games because like i kind of want to buy one for Prime Buy one. Day or Prime Week? Wait, Emma, who what? Wait, I was going to say, I forgot. I was going to say something. I don't know. Um. Oh, yeah. So, like, who has been on the show yet? Um. So, I have a, like, a list of some people who said, like, yeah, I'll totally be on the show. But uh, as for, I still need to get that set up, by the way, because I'm, uh, a lot of the, actually all of these people live either out of state, uh, they're like some internet friends, um, or they're just people who I can't see in mm. public or or can't meet up with yeah that's the word but um i have you guys are the second uh group of guests and i've had my mom and my sister oh. yeah i yeah, feel yeah. special so thank you mm. <laughs> i don't know um, yeah. back to conspiracy theories though uh there's mandela effects okay and Ooh, the yeah. thing about mandela effects is that like i don't necessarily like believe in them like i don't i don't really think that that and i think it's more people's memory than anything else but then it kind of gets weird when like okay there's one about snow white where instead of her saying mirror mirror on the wall it's magic mirror, magic mirror. on the wall like do you what i'd never seen snow white I mean, no but yeah I, I remember that one i i i am not too familiar with that line i don't remember which one it was but another one is like no i am your father or luke i am your father you yeah, know yeah it's definitely luke but then in the movie now it's it no. says no yeah that's not even true okay because it's like and and then there's one where it was like uh panic at the disco one and then the guy uh, who's in panic at the disco it was like his lyrics and then the guy in panic at the disco was like oh i don't even remember the lyrics being like that like what yeah, even him even oh him. no that's weird okay it's crazy panic. also um this is gonna sound so stupid so i'm just putting that out there sure. but um when i was younger i used to think instead of uh it just being the Arctic and Antarctica, I thought there was a place called Arctica. And I literally thought this for years. And then uh, out of nowhere, like very recently, I found out that it's not called Arctica. So I'm like silently laughing to myself. Okay, I'm sorry <laughs> that it's like embarrassing, but like it, I, I, I it's mean. It's like when you find out you've been singing the wrong lyrics for years. <laughs> yeah, literally that. Also like, um, I didn't know what a papaya was until I was in like freshman Ooh, year of high school. I love papayas. But... <laughs> Or did you know that cashews come from a fruit? That's from that one Tabuscus yeah. song. Oh, oh Tabuscus. I miss Tabuscus. So sad. Didn't I'm he so like... Sad that... So, yeah, he was, uh, like, accused of, like, rape allegations I and everything like that. Yeah, I... Um, I don't know. Like, I, I never got really fully invested in that. That's yeah, when I never I, really looked into it. Yeah, um, that's, that was before I looked into drama on YouTube. Don't eat arepas. Get it? It's, like, it's like Spanish. It's like... So yeah, and then I don't know. He, like his channel, his channel just died after that. His like um, reputation was like, ah. Uh, I, but I I miss Toby because I I loved his songs like what like Safety Torch, Nugget and Biscuit, I Could Swing My Sword. Oh, it's like such bops. Okay. okay. Anyways, um, yeah. Uh, I don't really know what to say about conspiracy theories now. Do you have any more, Emma? We, we've been talking about, like, many different things. Like, like I said at the beginning of the episode, we didn't know what we were talking about, so that's why it seems all over the place. ASMR. Yeah, it's an ASMR podcast where we just be like, hey, it's free real estate. No. <laughs> or what about the Twitch streamer Belle Delphine selling her used bath Ew. water? Okay, we were actually talking about this earlier. Okay, <laughs> She's My... cute. Okay, yeah, Belle Delphine is really pretty, but... She literally, like, if she has any diseases, there are guys who are drinking her bathwater. There are guys who are sitting in her bathwater. Like, oh. if she has, like, any diseases or any, like, sicknesses, like, they will get those. And I just want to put it out there. Do not buy people's bathwater. I know it's, like, a meme. It's funny. You know, literally don't do as it. As okay? entrepreneurship, I don't know what you're <laughs> talking about, 
But her parents would be freaking proud because she's selling fucking bath water. <laughs> so, so yeah, if you don't know like exactly what's been going on, so like there the Twitch streamer Belle Delphine, who isn't she like nineteen or something? Yeah, she's nineteen. She's one of those like 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 gamer girls who like um dress she's in like she's, cosplays. She's not really as much of a gamer girl as more as she's like an Instagram model. I would true, say. True, true, true. Yeah. yeah. I don't so know. well, first of all, she made um an account on <laughs> Hub. I'm definitely gonna have to censor that one. Um, Beep hub, anyways. Yeah, and she yeah she made a P hub account and was posting videos like uh like with misleading titles when she and it yeah. wasn't actual like, was like prawn yeah. videos and a lot of people were mad about that but then she took it a step further further and started to sell her used bath water and then uh, obviously like a bunch of old men were buying it and like 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 Emma said drinking it and I heard old that. Men. Um, yeah, you know, because that those are the people that watch. Like, but then, okay, so there's, like, a lot of, like, YouTubers, like, especially British commentators, which I, I you know, I like a good commentator. Don't bring up pyrocynical. Okay, literally, <laughs> that's what I was talking about. But, like, um, but they've been, like, making videos about Belle Delphine for a while, and now that her bathwater is here, like, there's gonna be, like, a million more videos about Belle Delphine. And All just, right, guys. Oh, my gosh. No! Okay, and, like, I love pyrocynical. You know, he's a, he's a He's funny, but like also He's like lesbians, yeah. But also like you need to, you know, talk about other things. Like no one cares about the bathwater, okay? No, it's just gross. It's does. nasty, and he drank it, and that that it messes me up. I heard that it's um, a personal gift too. Yeah, and I heard that some people were contracting herpes after drinking it. I don't know if so. that was true or not, but if it is, that is not. No, because I, I don't even know if it's her bathwater. Um, one time, like last week, I drank out of my boss's uh, like like water bottle and I looked up, can you get herpes from uh, sharing drinks? And you you can't actually. Turns out. Okay, but like bathwater is different. It's Duh. not her mouth. It's her whole body. It's literally her well, everything. Then, if you really love Belle Delphine, you want to ingest her. No. No. <laughs> That's so it's not funny. it. Okay. And, like, I love Belle Delphine. I, okay, love her is, like, an overstatement. But she is really pretty, and, like, she she isn't a bad person. But, like, also, like, why bathwater? Like, it just doesn't, like, I don't understand it. You why know? not, like, you know, like, bodily fluid? Um, I feel like that would sell a little bit better, but I don't really, I don't really know about Um, don't you have to be home at, like, 5 o'clock? Oh, yeah. Okay, right, it's 4.40, yeah. All right, so how about we wrap it up right here? Okay, uh, uh, subscribe to Jason M eighteen and also yeah um, that channel. <laughs> subscribe to uh, 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 neither of us have a YouTube channel. Um, edit out all the swears, please, Jason. Yeah, I I, I probably should. <laughs> okay. Okay. Well, thank you guys so much for listening. Uh, if you liked it, don't forget to like, favorite, comment, share, and subscribe. And hit the bell button. And uh, if you're gonna hit the bell button, you might as well tell your friends to hit the bell button. I didn't have time to put in the sound effect, so here it is right now. Okay, yeah. Ding! Okay. <laughs> okay, um, I will see you guys in the next episode. See you in the car. Goodbye. Bye. Bye. Yeah.